was to leave. Sorry. Didn't mean to wake you. Oh, you didn't sleep, did you? Neither did you. We haven't slept much at all these last few weeks. I... I hope you don't have any regrets. About this. About us. Do you have any? No. Not about this. What will we do now? Now that we're... Uh, what we are. We'll be married. And no one will be able to keep us apart. Not Griff. Not his father. Not Ramsay Snow. I was hoping you'd say that. Roderick? Oh! I'm sorry! I thought you were alone. Good morning, Talia. Hello, Elena. Oh, I, I didn't realize you two were... I mean, I didn't realize she was... It's all right, Talia. Come in. I really am sorry. It's just, this is urgent, Roderick. And... It's, it's all right. I can go. You two need to speak. I'll see you soon, I hope. All right, then. I'm listening. Last night, I couldn't... I was having nightmares, so I... Go on, Talia. I went back there. To the grove. And someone was there. What do you mean? Look. This is a report. How many fighting men we have? Where Griff and the White Hill garrison are being held? It even talks about Elena. I know. It's everything. I couldn't believe it. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes... You said you saw someone. Who? Someone we trusted. Talia, I need to know who it was. He's like family, Roderick. But it doesn't matter. He's a traitor. He endangered our house. You have to deal with him like you would any other man. I'm sure he had his reasons. But no reason is good enough. Dahlia, I'll do the right thing. You know me. I do know you. That's why I need you to promise. Promise me you'll kill him, Roderick. Anyone who would betray us like this deserves to die. I'm asking you as your sister. I give you my word, Talia. The traitor will get what he deserves. Now, tell me. Come with me. He's in the Great Hall. You scared the bloody daylights out of What's that? You tell me. You don't scare me, Roderick. I've known you since you were a boy. Why, Royland? Why did you do it? Your father was the greatest lord I've ever known. But you! You've brought this house to ruin! You pushed me to this, Roderick. I trusted you, Ryland. With my life. <laughs> You'll trust anyone who makes the right noises. You know why? Because you're weak. You're weak. 
just like Ethan was. Making Duncan his sentinel. Ethan was a boy. Ethan was a fool. And you've been making fool choices too since the day you crawled off that corpse cart. Letting Griff force you to the ground without a shred of dignity. Going to High Point without any soldiers, despite my every warning. Hell, you even managed to get Arthur killed! Enough, Royland! You've had every opportunity to save this family, but you've squandered them all. Your father would be ashamed. So you turn your cloak! That's your answer! I'm not gonna stand by and watch you destroy this family! You're driving House Forrester the way of the Starks. The only thing that matters is that you swore an oath to I swore to your father. I'd swear to Asher if he were here. But you're a cripple who can barely hold a sword. Asher knows how to act. Shut your fucking mouth. Finally showing some spine. Roderick, it's Griff. He's gone. Somebody set him free. Was this your doing? They were going to ambush you at the trade. I just saved your life. But Ryan... Ryan... How could you? This was his doing! Just sentence me and be done with it. Roderick, you promised. Kill me. And Asha dies too. <gasps> Please, Roderick. What do you mean? I know Lud's plans. Spare my life. And I'll tell you everything. Perhaps we should hear him out. He's only saying that to save himself. You must decide, my lord. You must be loving this, Duncan. Believe me, I'm not. I'll spare your life. Now talk. You're a bigger coward than he is. Mira cost Lud his army. He's desperate to strike back. He's going to ambush Asher the moment he makes landfall. No! You must protect Asher. Protect the true lord of this house. Take this traitor away. Get your hands off me! What Royland said. We have to warn Asher. We can't, not if he's at sea. My lord, what do we do? Prepare the horses. We're gonna defend my brother. Smell that. We're almost there, Pesca. Let's have a look. Come on, break it up! Save your lovemaking for below deck. They listen to you. Barely. But what happens if your Lord Brother decides he's the one in charge once we're at Iron Rack? Do you expect them to follow his orders? Or will it be you commanding them? They don't know him. A Lord sounds an awful lot like a master. Roderick. He's the lord of the house, and he's been bred for it. I understand, but these men and women have journeyed here to follow you, not him. Oh, you'll see when you meet him. Doesn't matter if he can't fight like he used to. All men learn to love Roderick. Hmm. That's odd. Port's quiet. No guards. Hardly any ships. Maybe they're all off fighting one of your king's wars. Could be. Or could be we'll have a fight on our hands. I'll let the others know. Right. Oh, this couldn't be easy, could it?
So, this is Westeros. Ugly and small. Fucking freezing, too. I said you'd be paid. I never said you'd be warm. Asha, thank the gods you've made it back. Good to see you, my lord. Hope you're ready for a fight. Lord knows you're coming. He sent men to intercept you. We need to hurry. Been stuck on a boat for weeks. Could use a good fight. from ice. Go! You bastard! Beska. You're fucking leaving me? What the fuck am I supposed to do? I came here for you! Stay by my brother's side. He's your family now. I will, little brother. Fucking hearts out! 